Greetings and salutations, folks. I'm Josh from Lazy Acres. Thank you for tuning in. We are saving the world here, one trailer at a time. We've got a brand new 2023 Grand Design Imagine, model number 18BH. We got bunks, we got a Murphy bed, side slide, aluminum frame, with a little bit of Asdell built into it. Weighs around 4,100 pounds or so. This is like taking a COVID test, but it's written. Say hello to my friend, that Dutch bad boy, Brendan Hannemeyer on the camera. How's it going, happy campers, future campers, and fellow salespeople? Thank you so much for stumbling upon the number one RV YouTube channel in the world. We got to like and subscribe button. I think you got to hit both of those. We're also on Instagram, we're on TikTok, and we're on Facebook. You should follow us along there. Comment section's open. I think you should leave some comments. Imagine Grand Design, they aimed for some perfection. They nailed it with these floor plans. I love them. Let me know what you think about them. And they're right on target, Brennan. This is a front power jack, 20 pumper paint tanks, battery in a box location, right in behind there. Fiberglass skin, aluminum front skin here in two pieces. Uh, great across the front. Pass through storage all the way through. We have motion sense of lights on both sides. You can see proof of the aluminum frame up and in. And then we have our outside shower, city water connection, fresh water fill, outside receptacle, battery disconnect, light for your sewer and then there right there is your solar charge controller it's a little bit different system on the imagine aims it's actually a 200 watt panel coming on these guys here's your slide pulling part of our kitchen off the floor we're going to get to it with travel access here we got our westlake 15 inch butter tires i just want to check the 15s 15 inch aluminum rims in through there secondary freshwater fill black water flush kit furnace vent Furion on-demand gas water heater. Little more storage here underneath the back bunk. We got yourself a roof ladder. Get up on your roof, check your seals. 30 amp detachable style cord. Outside shower right here, Brennan. Outside shower, Brennan. Outside shower and a little receiver. And then you got a little, bitty. yeah, class two receiver, Brennan. Outside speaker, outside speaker, outside receptacle, pardon me. And then check this out. Just a little bit of a cabinet here. Not taking up any space inside, really, and we get that griddle built in. Electric awning starting right at the back, going the full length of the trailer with LED lights in it. Dinette window, three-step aluminum tread steps, secure to the ground, lend a hand grab handle there. And then right here, we just got the other side of our pass-through storage. Now let's show this thing off in travel mode, Brandon. We got full access, full access. We got our couch right here. We got our fridge, nice and easy from the uh, side of the road. Side of the road, thank you, Brendan. We got this long countertop slash dinette. We're gonna get to that when we get in to the unit. Great travel access for the washroom, and you can even use the bunks. I guess the only limit here is you can't bring the Murphy bed down with the slide out in. Let's get this thing opened up. Right on, folks. We're inside that Imagine Aim 18BH. This is the best new thing this year. They destroyed it. This is amazing. This is it. Like this is this and the 16ML are lights out. This is so great. 18 foot trailer with this floor space on a single axle compact unit. No Magnifique. Problem. Yeah, formidable. Yeah. Right. Um, yeah. Anyway, into this thing here. We got. Two large drawers underneath the Murphy. We got two regular sized drawers beside the Murphy bed. And we're used to this, right? From Imagine, hanging bar right through there. To bring this down to a Murphy bed, super slick and easy, just like usual. Roll Think that about over. how much storage is in just such a small trailer like this. I mean, it's just phenomenal. Like, wait till you get to the pantry. That pops down. We still got the cubby holes with the receptacles and the USB lights, sorry, the USB plugs. White lights or blue, depending on how you want to set those up. Nice shelf right across the top of that. And then check out this flexible area here. So they give you four stools. They fold up out of the way nice and easy. Really easy to use. You definitely have four seats here because there's four spots for your feet. This is just... Clever. It's clever, right? Like it's really smart. I'm sitting here, I'm looking out to where my awning is, where my campsite is. I've got a receptacle and a USB right there. I've got a TV facing the couch action. Just fantastic space in here. What's up? Down that Bring that down? Yeah, let me show this off a little better. How's that there? That looks great. 
It's it's bright here today in really Ontario. Very bright, and this unit's very bright. Great counter space yep. in through here. Spot to even kick off the shoes underneath there too, if you want, right? Like there's all kinds of space. Um, that is just fantastic. And then you still have a lot of space here, right? Like look at the width in through here with this great kitchen. We've got a uh, compass connect system, our on-demand water heater controls. We've got a big cupboard right there. Three cutlery drawers right here. That same countertop continues over here. The undermount like boat style sink, which is super slick, gives you more counter space. Then we've got our two burner stove top here. Blue lights on that, convection microwave down below. Pot and pan drawer perhaps, Brendan? Yes. Look how they've done that just to line that up. That's a smaller drawer, right? But they've, they've extended the drawer face to make nice. it look nice and lined up there. That's fantastic. We've got our uh, 12 volt fridge here. 6.2 cubic feet. Thank you, Brandon. More cupboard space here across the top for plates and cups and whatever else. More of that here. More of that here, right? And then we got the bunks behind this wall, but check out that backsplash, that's killer. Bunks are there, but let's take a look at this. For pantry slash coat slash kids clothes, all this, oh my goodness, Brandon. Look at this. So well placed, everything is true. Yeah, kind of like a little bit of, um, I don't want to say Winnebago vibe, but a little bit of that worry where they just jam so much storage in through here. We got single over single bunks. Both bunks have windows, both bunks have lights. That's where we got the extra two stools right for now. That's awesome. Now, usually in this size of trailer, you don't get a bathroom sink, and we're gonna show you that here shortly, but the dump truck fits in here. I got great space for the hips. This pops down, turns into the sink. We got that action right in through there. And a, 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 a medicine cabinet. Yeah. Is that actually gonna open for me? Yeah, it is, brother. Look at that. Nice window here at the back. <clears throat> and then up into the shower. I'm six feet tall in an 18 foot bunkhouse, and your boy Josh fits in here easily. We got that same Nauto style door. We've come to love. Skylight right above me. Shower surround. Everything you need, folks. Hit that like button. Hit the subscribe button. Hit us up on Instagram, Facebook, TikTok. Have yourself a good day.